Hi, this is Dan Brunton with the Intel Corporation, and in this video, I'll be giving you an introduction to Intel Endpoint Management Assistant. Let's just start out with the basic question, what is Intel EMMA? As I've mentioned, it stands for Endpoint Management Assistant. It's a new tool from Intel for allowing you to manage computers remotely, even through firewalls. And if you have Intel Active Management technology, which comes with the Intel vPro platform, uh, you can do even more to manage those devices at a hardware level, even when the OS is down. Uh, Intel Emma can be installed on premises or in the cloud, and also includes a set of APIs that you can use to integrate Intel Emma capabilities into other tools. So why Intel Emma? Well, to be direct, we know that the management landscape is changing. Uh, people don't just work inside the office anymore. Uh, we're far more mobile than we have been ever. Uh, we also know that you know, the nature of IT is different. You no longer want to run software necessarily on premises. So you want to be able to have it in the cloud. Uh, we also recognize the fact that, hey, you know, we constructed this whole cool thing uh, with Intel AMT uh, years ago before the idea of cloud-based management came into play, and now we want to make sure that we have a tool that meets the demands of today's IT workforce that allows AMT to stay relevant and useful in this environment where we're shifting from running software on-premises to the cloud. For those of you not familiar with the Intel vPro platform, let me take a moment to describe what it is. It's going to give you great performance, great security, great stability, and then what we'll be focusing on in this series of videos, manageability, and that comes in the form of Intel Active Management Technology. So as I just mentioned, with Intel Active Management Technology on the Intel vPro platform, there's a lot of great things you can do at a hardware level to manage devices. Uh, remote power control is a popular one. We have a hardware-based alarm clock that allows you to automatically wake systems up. Uh, one of my favorite features is hardware KVM that gives me the ability to remotely control a computer at a hardware level and see exactly what's happening on it as if I was there in person while I'm completely remote. As we've mentioned with Intel Endpoint Management Assistant, now we have the ability to take uh, advantage of all these cool features beyond the firewall and using cloud-based manageability. So a question we often get about Intel Active Management Technology is, how does it work? What do we mean when we say out of band? Well, let me take a moment to explain. In the larger diagram, you can see an example of what a wired platform would look like, where we have our network, management traffic coming off of that network straight into the network interface card, and that goes right to the Intel Management Engine and Intel Active Management Technology running in the chipset. So all the management commands are stripped off right there, and then the balance of the traffic gets passed on to the operating system. Now, the process works a little different for systems that are running with wireless. In the case of a system that's using wireless with the operating system online, management traffic actually comes into the OS and then gets passed back to the Intel management engine. And that's just because of the nature of how uh, the architecture of wireless network interfaces work. However, if the system is not running the OS, then management traffic will go straight to the chipset because Intel AMT will get on the wireless network itself, authenticate using you know, 802.1x or uh, passwords, and allow you to manage that system wirelessly again, at the hardware level. So when we say out of band, what we mean here is that all this management happens in the chipset independent of the operating system. Well, that concludes the introduction video, and I look forward to talking to you more about Intel Endpoint Management Assistant in the upcoming videos. Thank you for watching.